Hey guys, it's Uncle Jonah here. Once again, I'm drinking beer. I'm sure none of you will be surprised at that. And this week we've got another one from the uh, Canterbury series. This one's Curious Brew, and it's a pair of reviews I, uh, I'm going to do. And sneakily, I didn't actually buy this one in Canterbury. This one uh, I got from Waitrose, and it's a lovely, lovely, lovely brew. Um, Sars and Cascade Hops. It's made with champagne yeast. Um, yeah, they do like a dual, they do a dual yeast. They ferment it out, then they add the champagne yeast at the end to get it super clear. Um, and it's also got Nelson Sauvignon hops, which we all know gives that kind of um, Antipodean, Oceanian kind of taste. Look at that bottle. Very, very cool. Are you curious yet? Well, you might be curious because there's a uh, there's a question mark on the top. And curious are part of Chapel Down, and they're a winery in Kent. Obviously, you might have had their uh, their brews or their wines before, and they're branching out into beer. And let me tell you, they've done some proper beer. The only downside and these new breweries tend to um, be guilty of because they obviously want to get their profit margins up. Guess what? It's a 33 litre bottle, which I don't like. Look at that. Super clear, super fizzy, obviously because of the champagne yeast. Got a very, very white head and we're looking finger, finger and a half. Say a thumb, thumb head on that one. Right, let's get my nose in. Mmm, getting some fragrance, but... Mmm, interesting. Not really getting the Cascade. If anything, I might, I might be getting the, uh, the Nelson Savoy hops. So maybe they've used the Cascade for bittering. We'll find out. Mmm, super, super smooth. Now this, you might have seen, right in the bottom of that label, see those words, lager. So this is a lager beer. They call it a lager beer. It's a lager, mate. But it's hopped, hop lager. Very nice. This one's quite, quite tame. The other one I had, I've, I've drunk this in a restaurant actually. Mm. and I was picking out more of the hops this one maybe it's been in the uh, in the supermarket for a while but let me tell you this is very very smooth super smooth if you like lagers not mentioning any names um, and you also like some hoppage this is by far a better way of getting into the hops so yeah, if you're looking for some nice hops to try, get this one. It's definitely got that crisp kind of taste from the lager. But it's very smooth. It's almost like a, ger a German lager. What's the uh, ABV? 4.7, but then it's only a little diddler of a bottle. Um, so you're not gonna you're not gonna have more than sort of two or three of these, I, I don't think. But yeah, new new style. So if you're curious, make sure you pick up a curious brew. Very very good beer. If you can get past the old small bottle, which I sometimes I have a very big challenge with it. Tonight I'm not too bothered because I know this is quite a good beer. Oh. Anyway, Curious Brew, get some if you're curious. Uncle Jonah here, I'll be back with more beer, more fun, to a PC, a tablet, maybe even your smart TV. Gonna be back real soon. Cheers and beers.